Okay, guys, we got some new alleged reports coming out of North Carolina and Tennessee. And since the mainstream news is not covering this, we definitely have to go with il alleged reports. This is all alleged, but this is new news, and it's extremely important, so pay attention. Not only do we have the complete devastation in the homeless issue, people are without homes, they are without power, but now they are getting sick. Apparently, there is a nuclear fuel station about an hour and a half outside of Asheville. Now, originally, they had said that there were training barrels that had got washed away into the river, into the water. However, they are now allegedly stating that these were not training barrels. And it was actually a semi full of nuclear fuel that got buried 10 to 20 feet under the mud. So they have verified that this truck is in the water, in the mud with all of these barrels of fuel. Now, that is not to say that is what is making people sick. However, it could definitely be contributing to it. You've got sewers that have ruptured. You've got just um, dead animals, dead bodies, and everything is contaminated. So allegedly, there is about 60 people up on the mountain right now that are sick with something that they just don't know what they're sick with. Um, a man that brought 10 cadaver dogs to the Carolinas now has four dead dogs and six actively dying. Um, the horses that were brought out of the river, they were also very sick. And so they started doing blood work on these animals and finding out that they have all kinds of stuff in their blood. They are very sick. So not only are we dealing with complete devastation, now we are dealing with contamination that is making the animals and the people sick, allegedly. So I needed to get this out to you. We need to spread this far and wide. Stay out of the mud. If you can stay out of the mud, stay out of the mud. Stay away from the water. It is contaminated. Um, yeah, I guess that's it for now, guys. And as I progress with this story, I will update you guys. Stay safe. Godspeed. Talk to you soon.